Ignition and adjustment of the MC series mechanical modulating burners. Mechanical modulation is performed through a variable profile cab fixed to a servo motor. This cam uses two levers to control air and gas throttle opening and closing. Warning: The video is only for didactic purpose. The indications given may not be correct for all applications. Carefully read the use and maintenance manual supplied with the burner before carrying out any operation. The burner assembly and adjustment procedures described in the video must be performed by Balta authorized technicians only. The ignition consists of two phases, pre-adjustment with no flame and adjustment with flame. Pre-adjustment with no flame. In this phase, we will describe the main operations and pre-adjustments to be carried out before starting the burner. Make sure there are no gas leaks in the pipe. Check that the ramp inlet gas pressure is suitable to the valve model used. Pre-adjust the gas stabilizer by fully tightening the screw counterclockwise. And loosening it again by about 20 full turns clockwise. Move the operating valve to fully open position. Move the valve opening starter to half of its full stroke. Pre-adjust the air servo motor cams. Adjust cam 1, maximum air and gas opening, to 120 degrees. Adjust cam 2, air and gas total closing to 0 degrees. Adjust cam 3, air and gas minimum opening to 10 degrees. Adjust cam 4, ignition point to 30 degrees. Adjust cam 5, Ignition transformer switching on, 10 degrees above cam 4. Adjustment with flame. In this phase, we will start and adjust the burner. If the ignition is correct and the detector detects the flame, adjust the burner.
The burner starts on the suitable ignition cam. Manually set the burner to minimum cam position. Use the suitable combustion analyzer to check the fumes. Adjust oxygen quantity between 3.5 and 5.5% in all modulation points by increasing or decreasing the air using the adjustment screw of the plate on which the lever for air throttle adjustment runs. Loosen the air adjustment screws to decrease the oxygen quantity. Tighten the plate adjustment screws to increase the oxygen quantity. After making sure to work safely without carbon monoxide in the fumes, bring the burner to maximum power step by step, checking that, using the combustion analyzer, no carbon monoxide is created in the fumes and that the flame does not turn off due to excess air. and use the maximum air plate adjustment screw to adjust the oxygen quantity in order to optimize combustion. Read the gauge to measure the amount of burned gas cubic meters. Make sure that the delivered power matches the boiler furnace power. Use the valve pressure stabilizer to increase or decrease the power. Check valve gas outlet variation with the suitable pressure port. Adjust combustion air according to the new quantity of burned gas. Repeat the same operation on each air adjustment screw, decreasing the servo motor position by 10 degrees at a time. Optimize combustion through the various air adjustment screws up to maximum power. Now the burner will start modulation using a properly configured load controller.